Well, it just got done raining like crazy. There's water everywhere and really can't do much. So I figured I would do a little video um, on a review of some goosenecks, talking about goosenecks, all that kind of good stuff. The first one I got here is a PJ 32 foot uh, dual tandem. Bought this new in, I think it was 2017. Real nice trailer. I've been real happy with it. The uh, I noticed a couple I see on the road. If you when you get one, you want to make sure you get the primer option on the paint. There's some out there that don't have that option. They're just painted and they will will rust pretty quick. This has been holding up real nice. I like the paint job with this. Uh, dual jacks, drop leg down. Those are nice, nice and smooth. Toolbox is up front here. Mine is absolutely a mess. You got your chain rail back in here. Hydraulic. You can lock it down here. Uh, you got your steps coming up on. Everything's real solid on it. I do like it. Nice built trailer. It's got the Dexter oil bath uh, axles. Went with the mega ramps. It was a good option to get. It's real nice so you don't have to carry a third ramp or something and you can have 32 foot of flat deck. They are kind of heavy. Um, they're not terrible, but you know they're there. They're spring assist. Uh, you can pin them down like they are or you can you come down to here and pin them up. Overall been a good trailer. I haven't hauled a ton with it yet. It is heavy. It weighs about 7,500 pounds, I believe. Uh, Three-quarter ton pickup. It's a lot for it, but it'll do it. The only thing I haven't been happy about is some of the cuts. You can see, like, right there. Some of the welds they didn't clean up. Up through here. And some of this metal, if you come back in here, you can see it's almost pitted. And they uh, just painted over it and... You know, I've, I figured you'd get a nice piece of metal when you're paying that kind of money for a trailer. But, yeah, overall, very happy with it. Very happy with the quality. If I was going to buy another one, it would probably be a PJ um, or a Delta. This is my, uh, I think it's a 2003 Delta 25 foot. I've put more miles on this than know what to do with. It is uh, it's held up real well. It's an older trailer, but it's stout. Um, decent paint for the year. I mean, it's built extremely heavy. Axles kind of far in the back. That's the only thing I don't like about it. And I don't like the single jack, but I've been using it for so long. Just one of the things you got used to. Uh, amount of toolbox in it. Got the winch mounted on it. Just a very basic trailer. Um, pop up dove on this one ramps grain drill falling off there it's a good trailer still original floor decking i'd recommend a delta anyone looking for one looking for a gooseneck they make a very very nice trailer they don't have as many options as a pj does but delta does make a, a very stout trailer um the only one i'd really stay away from is i'm not a huge big tex fan i think uh they just seem to cut a lot of corners with wiring and paint and everything like that. So, yeah, if you guys have any questions, uh, feel free to drop them below. Let me know what you guys think, what you guys want to see, um, and subscribe. Thank you.